it's like, it's like nothing, you know, nothing you can experience. For most people, it's not something they'd ever want to experience. Chris Zinnel considers it art, with tattoos and body piercing, but what he does with these hooks in his back is unbelievable. If you just concentrate, you focus, you know, you don't think about the pain, you just let it happen. The pain Chris feels is after he attaches the hooks in his skin to metal chains and then hangs there. It's kind of like a full body massage, I guess. Once, you know, you kind of get used to it and, you know, your body gets adjusted to the hooks and the pulling, you know, you just feel it through your whole body. It's pretty amazing. And it gets even more bizarre. Chris swings on the hooks to stretch out his skin more. The whole process takes several hours, with the most painful part when the hooks are put in or taken out. So your skin's pretty strong. So your living tissue is very, very strong. You gotta do a lot to break it. And plus the hooks are put in pretty deep and they're very thick. Chris started hanging himself several years ago. He'd seen pictures of tribes using the process for religious and spiritual ceremonies. But Zinnel says for him, this isn't torture, it's fun. What do you think about when you're up there? Um, actually, I really don't know. Really nothing. Nothing in particular. Just, you know, just getting through it. You know, getting, getting off my feet and, um, you know, hanging. He's done this exhibition in several shows, but he says it's not something he can do every week. He's only done it five times, and each time it takes a while for his back to heal. Chris says, though, no matter what the price, he'll be hanging around again sometime soon. It really is, son. I'm not a freak, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> Christina Huey, Channel 5, Eyewitness News.